Don't you watch Netflix and movies and stuff like that? Not that much. Not as okay, much so as you probably do. The, the time that you're watching a Netflix show, you can be doing your hair. The time that you're watching a Netflix show, you can get a real job and stop harassing black women. How am I harassing black women? This is I asked you a question. Excuse me, ma'am. How do we get more black women to wear their hair natural just like you? So what's the name of your YouTube? Stop playing Trey. Stop playing Trey. Yeah, stop playing Trey. Uh, hi, stop playing Trey. How are you? I'm doing good as well. Yeah, I'm just trying to see how we get more black women to wear their hair natural because I see a lot of natural hair and it looks very nice. I don't know. They guess we got to be confident. Mm. So where, where does that stem from? Like, Within. But what if they're not confident and they wear like wigs and weaves every single day? I don't like wearing weaves and stuff. It's just too much work for me. I just like to wake up and go and do stuff like mm -hmm. that. How do you get more black women to start wearing their natural hair like you? Yeah. Just stop caring about what the world thinks. And why do you think a lot of black women today want to be white, though? By like wearing like the 613 blonde wigs. You said that they wanted to be white. By the six, just... 613 blonde wigs? Where else are they getting but, that from? But regardless, maybe they just want to have blonde wig on for the day. That don't mean that they want to be white. They just want blonde hair. If, it, if it's for the day, okay. But for it's the not... Week, for it's... the month, however long they want to be Come on now. Like... But who are they getting that from, though? themselves if they are unique and they want to have blonde hair for the day they have all right to have blonde hair. but straight blonde hair is predominant to white women so you think um black women get blonde hair because they want to be like white women that's what you're saying low-key yeah because like that's so unfortunate if you wanted to be black you would just keep it your same hair color and not get straight hair because straight hair too means you might want to be white as well i mean but women also straighten their natural hair so it's like it's because they get a weave on a real straight just like i said who wants to put heat and stuff on a natural come, hair come, 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 come. you should want to do that right. so it's like of course if i want to wear some straight hair if it's not whatever color hair, it is i can wear that it's whatever yeah, i want to put heat on my natural hair every day because like you said i'm black and i love my hair that's why i wear natural styles that's also a protection hairstyle so it's a protection hairstyle thank you stop capping right now her roots are not blonde. What are you talking about? She naturally has ombre. Like, who cares? Like, why you she naturally has blonde tips. Are you going to do this all day? You going to walk around and ask people to... Yeah, that's, 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 that's what I do. Why? Yeah. why what do you mean? Care? Tell me why you care. Because all the fake hair is destroying the black women today. This is It's destroying them? Destroying. The hair. All the things in the world, but the hair is what's destroying black women. Yeah. Okay. I think yeah. you're like white You always have that one person that says things that doesn't make any logical sense at all. How does me advocating black women's natural hair and saying that fake hair is destroying black women, how does that have anything to do with me liking a white woman? It's because it doesn't have anything to do with me liking white women. What they try to do is deflect the conversation onto anybody else. Every time I have these conversations, they're like, oh, why don't you talk about the black men who are killing each other? Why don't you talk about the white women who get BBLs? Why don't you talk about the wars that are happening in the world? That's not the topic of this conversation. But I don't understand like why it matters. Like people should be able to be who they want to be. They should be able to wear the hair they want to hair wear. Like it really doesn't matter. In 30, 40 years from now, if you knew you were going to be bald and have like alopecia and different conditions like this, would you keep continuing to wear like fake hair? That's what they yes. wear them for because they have alopecia, so they're not able to. Im what? Not so you're saying if you lose your alopecia, hair, would I miss it years them. later? No, I'll throw a wig on that hoe and keep it pushing. Oh! You can lose your hair due to the fake hair in your head. It, like, it damages your natural hair. Is that a Twitter take? <laughs> Did you just what is say it? that up? Grows That's not true. It is true. The wigs. No. The wigs. Oh, wigs do as well. They, they, your hair will fall out from a wig? Who yeah, it can. You that? It can. Did, so, did Twitter okay, tell you so that? It's not the wig. So this is the How old are you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. One question. So it's the glue and the I'm wig. Sure. It's the it's difference. Me. Glue messes up your hair, and that's only like the surface. A wig does not mess up your hair. It's also protective style. You can get glue, with weeds, or sew and stuff like that. It's protective style. It protection. doesn't allow your scalp to breathe. So I don't know how many times I've said this, but. Wigs are not a protective hairstyle. Wigs are a cover-up hairstyle or a hairstyle to hide what is under the wig. The hairstyle that's really protecting your hair is whatever you have under that wig. So maybe twists, cornrows, or whatever you have under there. And wigs can actually do damage in the long run. You guys can do your own research. I'm just gonna read this from an article that I found 
by just doing five minutes of research. Common causes of hair loss from wigs include traction alopecia due to tight fitting, constant tension on hair follicles, leading to gradual thinning and scalp damage from improper wig application, such as using adhesives or clips. These factors can disrupt hair growth cycles and result in temporary or permanent hair loss. Your mama do hair? Does somebody do hair? No, nah, she, nah. Nobody? Okay. No. You just making this up. I'm not. Because the friction of the, the, the fake hair can break off your natural hair. You know, like, you didn't have, know that? like, caps and things that we put underneath our wigs. Yeah. To protect our hair. And that's why I get but sweaty also, under there. Like They're also ventilated. We have ventilated caps as well. Toilet, and you, you could just take it off. Why? When you get home, like most girls, they take it off. Let their hair breathe. They could rebraid their hair and wash it. But what is what is the point in that when you have your natural hair? Like your hair looks nice. So why do you? I appreciate it. I wear wigs too. Why? Because it's a protective style. So the weather can actually do damage to your hair. So when you're outside and you're wearing your hair out like this every time, all the time, every day, it's actually not good for your hair. It breaks off your ends. It makes them very brittle. You have to turn around, do different hair mask treatments, deep conditioning, all of that, just to keep your hair safe. So mm -hmm. if me wearing my hair underneath a wig is going to protect my hair in the winter time, the fall time, or whenever I feel like it, I'm going to put my shit in a wig. But there's black women, there's tons of black women that have natural hair. And they wear it all the time. They never put any type of wig okay, or weave. So because what that about, is their choice. But so That's why, their preference. Why, they, if they want to wear a wig every single day because they don't want to do their hair every day, what's the problem? Why is there some black women that has, just have natural hair and the weather doesn't damage their natural hair? Like That is their choice. That's what they chose to do. If they want to put in the extra work to keep their hair super duper moisturized so it's mm -hmm. not breaking anymore. So is weather an excuse then? Not necessarily. It's a, either you can, you just you want to, or mm -hmm. for somebody like me, I do it for the weather. So wait, what do you mean you're so over this? Why? I'm so over this. This is such a ridiculous take. Do you you know are a man worried about women's hair. hair. You don't have to do the work. Yeah, like you don't have to do the work. Like why are you worried about it? This is so ridiculous. Do you know when you if you had natural hair like a black woman, you want to wake up every day and do your natural hair? That's a lot of work. So you brought this mic on to walk around asking these. You can wake up and just do that. We can't do that. Women who are insecure to wear their natural hair will make up any excuse in the book and try to make you believe everything that they're trying to say. If you're the average person on the street, you'll say, dang, that does make sense. She shouldn't have to do her hair every single day. But she doesn't have to do her hair every single day. That is a lie that they try to convey to you because they want to continue to wear the fake hair on their head. But let's get this straight. Hair does not have to be done every single day, especially as a black woman. You don't have to do your hair every single day. If you're doing a wash and go, you're choosing to do that hairstyle that has to be done every day. And no, that's nobody's fault but yours that you chose that hairstyle. But there's so many other hairstyles that you can do that last you a long time. Twists, braids, even an afro. That's the hit his mic we have to, to make these type work. of ridiculous tapes. Hold on, can I respond to her though? Why she just walk away? Oh God, are you she not tired me. yet? Okay. If no. you want to get the response that you want to get, how about you go ask a white woman why black women wear wigs like and whatnot? That. Yeah, because that's really what you want. Or go ask the Hispanic woman because that's that's. No, I'm that's trying what to see why like, you guys right? do it because I think black women's hair like. is beautiful, but I, do I don't too, see but it I don't like have time. barely. I don't have time. Why? I don't have time. You got kids. You why don't you have time? You can't. You why, can't have. Why don't you have time though? Doing this type of shit. Why don't? Why don't? People don't do this. Why don't you have time? I don't have time. How many hours you got in your day? Why don't you have time? I don't have time. That's what I'm telling you. Why though? Like, what does your day consist of? That's, hold on. I, I want to see why she doesn't have time. Like, it's a <laughs> exactly. this is so no, but ridiculous. I asked the question I'm first. You what I'm doing I asked her first. Oh, she's not going to tell me? You're not going to tell you me? You want me to explain my day? I'm telling you that yeah. I don't have time. Yeah. If you would have saw my day, I just want to know because a lot of black women say that, but they never say what they do. Are you a black woman? How do you know what they're doing all day? You but don't know. Why don't you have time though? Because black women don't just don't want to explain themselves to you. I don't no, have to no, explain you though. To you. Okay, okay. If you're not, I don't gonna, have to. Uh, I'm telling your... you, I don't have time. That's why I don't wear my natural hair. Okay, so what is your it, day? It doesn't consist matter of? what my day consists of. It's no time in that day for my hair. Any day. No. I braid my daughter's hair three times a week. You think I want to do my hair every morning? Like, you're tripping. Bye. This is dumb. Wait, don't they still have to go to the salon to get the hairstyle that they have in their hair right now? Right? So, 
when you get your hair done, why can't you get your hair done by the person who's doing your hair in a natural hairstyle? It will be cheaper because you're not putting in any fake hair. It will take less time because all you have to do is braid your natural hair and not the other hair inside of it. So why can't you just do that style? But a lot of women like this will make a lot of excuses and reasons why they don't have time to do their natural hair. When you get your hair done, maybe a couple of times a month by a stylist. So why can't you let them do your hair in a natural hairstyle? Don't you watch Netflix and movies and stuff like that? Not that much. Not as okay, much so as you probably do. The, the time that you're watching the Netflix show, you can be doing your hair. The time that you're watching a Netflix show, you can get a real job and stop harassing black women. How am I harassing black women? This is ridiculous. I asked you a question. It's funny to me how they always try to spin the narrative and say, I'm harassing somebody. When if you watch the video from the beginning, I came over there and I'm asking them, how do we get more black women to wear their natural hair? Because their hair is beautiful. I called the, the girls who were wearing their natural hair. I called that beautiful. And I wasn't even talking to this lady right here. I was talking to the other people in her group, but she wanted to jump in and conversate with me. So I'm harassing you and you started talking to me? Make that make sense. No one here agrees with your take. You think you're I know you don't agree on this terrible Twitter take and no one's going to agree. With I don't even have Twitter. I don't know what you're talking about. Real life. What is like, the Twitter real take? People. What was your question, man? I just want to know, like, do you have the time to do your hair? And yes. do you do your own hair? Yes. Okay, so if you feel like you have the time to do your own hair, is that not your own preference? Hey, how are you? It's not a preference. I make time. Okay, but if you have the time and you want to make time, do you, don't you think other people can choose what they want to make their time for? They can. So that's my question, though. Why don't you make time for your hair? Huh? Oh, yeah. Yo, they they're not trying to answer my questions at all, but yeah. Alright y'all, y'all have a great day. I appreciate that.